talk about upholstery cleaning and fabric cleaning. Now, according to an industry survey that was done, people who'd had their carpet cleaned by a professional noted that upholstery cleaning was the most likely service that the technician suggested as a add-on sale. Now, let's think about that for a minute. Why would upholstery cleaning be the most likely add-on sale? Isn't it the highest risk, lowest profit margin add-on service that you offer? With all due respect to some of my industry friends and instructors who love upholstery cleaning, I'd tell you it is the highest risk, lowest profit margin thing. So why do we offer it? Well, number one, it's an easy sale. And number two, and probably most importantly, it's because the customer asks for it and expects it and needs it. The truth is, though, that most upholstery is easy to clean. The reason that sometimes we're a little bit hesitant about it is that a very small risk still exposes us as the cleaning technician to a very large potential loss. Now, there's a lot of big words that are thrown around when you go to a upholstery cleaning class or you become a IICRC certified upholstery and fabric cleaning technician. They throw words at you like microfiber and weaves and textures and cellulosic man-made fibers. Isn't that an oxymoron? Polymer-based synthetic fibers, multiple layers of fabric, and they talk about these cleaning codes on the, on the couch. I thought if you ripped that tablet off, that little piece of fabric off on the couch, that you went to jail forever for breaking some federal law. You see, why, why are we a little nervous about upholstery cleaning? I'll tell you why. Because you can do everything right. You can use the exact right procedures, the exact right cleaning solutions, and occasionally, very occasionally, you can still have something go very wrong. In other words, you can do the right thing and still get punished. But don't let that scare you. Because it's real simple. As I said earlier, most upholstery is easy to clean. Now, the other thing I don't want you to do is do the opposite of being a little bit fearful of upholstery, and that's get what I call hero syndrome. There are times when upholstery is so dirty or you can't make enough money at it that just because you can clean it doesn't mean you should. Let me show you an example. We were filming a video on the amazing new Drymaster 3 upholstery tool and we asked if anybody had a really difficult piece of upholstery to clean. One of our folks found this one in a swamp and brought it in and asked us to clean it. It cleaned up pretty well except for the mold and mildew and fish smell. So you see, sometimes it's just too far gone. But you know what? All joking aside, let's be honest. Most problems in upholstery cleaning are caused by two things. Over wetting the fabric and using the wrong cleaning solution on the fabric. We can prevent over wetting by using the Hydramaster Drymaster upholstery cleaning tool. So what do we do about making sure that we're using the right chemical? That's what we're here to talk about today. Let's start with a basic discussion of the differences between cleaning carpet and cleaning upholstery. A lot of cleaning technicians ask, rightly so, why can't I just use my favorite carpet pre-spray on upholstery? Well, let's look at some of the differences. The first thing that you have to understand is that there's a different thickness in the fabrics. Think of the thickness of carpet, think of the thickness of upholstery. In upholstery, you can have layers of fabric on top of each other. Upholstery fabrics are usually woven. Carpet is usually tufted. And then finally, think about what's behind it. With carpet, you have a wood or a concrete subfloor. With upholstery, you most likely have a cushion, and behind that you have a wooden frame or a metal frame. So what's behind the carpet or the upholstery makes a difference in how it's clean. But probably from a chemical solution standpoint, the most important differences are in what kinds of soil affect upholstery. Upholstery is exposed to a much higher level of skin and body oils. 
one of its main components when they've removed soil from a, a piece of upholstery by vacuuming and then analyzed what's in it is dead skin. That's right, dead skin. You and I, they say, at least they taught me in my biology class, was that we all go through about seven layers of skin every year. Where does all that dead skin go? A lot of it's into the upholstery. The third thing that's going to affect upholstery different than carpet is hair treatments and sprays and gels and mousses and creams and you name it. How about dippity do? Well, most of you are too young to know what that is. A fourth thing that affects upholstery fabrics are airborne oils. You see, every cooking oil, every atomized oil from manufacturing, every oil that gets into the airspace and travels through the ventilation system eventually settles down. And where it usually settles down onto is the upholstery. And of course, we know that upholstery is the favorite place for our dogs or cats to lay and lay and lay. I don't know about at your house, but in my house, I have to kick the dog out of my chair when I get home. Upholstery is exposed to a lot of pet hair, and the concentrations of pet hair are much higher. And then finally, a lot of times when we're sitting in our favorite chair on our favorite sofa or say favorite couch, we're eating or drinking, and those things often spill and get onto the upholstery. So you have different types of fiber with different soiling conditions that require specialty cleaning solutions. Now, remember that most upholstery is actually a blend of more than one fiber. You're not gonna find a lot of 100% this fiber or 100% that fiber. Whatever the case, the main goal in upholstery cleaning is to remove as much soil as possible without changing the color or the texture of the fabric. That's why cleaning solutions are so important. Now let's talk specifically about your cleaning solutions. The first one that I want to talk to you about is Fabric Master HD Upholstery Spray Spray. Fabric Master HD Upholstery Spray Spray is designed for the upholstery cleaning craftsperson. While many cleaners do use carpet pre sprays on upholstery, the craftsperson recognizes those important differences that we've talked about between upholstered fabrics and carpeting as well as the soils that build up in them. Fabric Master HD is a self-neutralizing formula that cleans with the power of non-odored ammonia, gives it lots of alkalinity, but then it self-neutralizes as it dries. It is designed for use on synthetic upholstery fabrics. It does all of this with the cleaning power of that odorless ammonia combined with specialized solvents and surfactants. Fabric Master HD is effectively designed to break down, dissolve, and emulsify the soils and spills that are most common to upholstery fabrics. And it contains a special stain removing additive. It's the same one that's in our Spot Master Pro XP spotter that effectively eliminates many beverage spills and stains without the need for any special stains treatments. Fabric Master HD is more concentrated than most of the competitive solutions. You can use it from straight up to one to three. Remember, because it's self-neutralizing, you can use it on virtually any synthetic or primary synthetic upholstery fabric. Fabric Master HD is your going to be your most often go-to pre-spray for upholstery cleaning. If you're an upholstery cleaning craftsperson, then you really want to learn more about Fabric Master Fine Fabric Pre-Spray. One of the things that you should keep in mind about Fabric Master Fine Fabric is that it recognizes the construction and texture of the upholstery to be more delicate than carpeting. So it doesn't use harsh solvents that are often used in carpet pre-sprays that can literally affect how the upholstery is constructed and the texture. The Fabric Master Fine Fabrics Pre-Spray is specially designed to break down, dissolve, and emulsify the soils that we've talked about that are most common to upholstery cleaning. 
Fabric Master Fine Fabric Pre-Spray is designed to break down, dissolve, and emulsify the soils that are most common to upholstery fabrics. The neutral pH cleaning formula is specifically formulated for use on delicate, natural upholstery fabrics. Those constructed with natural fibers, those with special, delicate, and intricate weaves, textures, and patterns. Now, one of the things that you need to know about Fabric Master Fine Fabric Pre-Spray, which separates it from all of the other cleaning solutions that we manufacture, it contains a very specialized surfactant. Most surfactants are designed as wetting agents to wet the fabric. Well, we know that with natural upholstery, overwetting the fabric is what causes the problem. So we use a specialized surfactant in Fabric Master Fine Fabric Pre-Spray that allows you to clean the surface without soaking the back of the fabric. No other cleaning solution in our industry specifically for upholstery cleaning contains that exact same surfactant. Fabric Master Fine Fabric Pre-Spray is for your natural fabric, cotton and delicate weaves, and patterned upholstery fabrics. You can use it from straight to 1 to 16, so it's more concentrated than most of the competitive solutions. And as we already talked about, its neutral pH keeps you from causing alkaline-related problems in upholstery cleaning. Another cleaning solution from Clean Master is Wool Master Rug and Fabric Pre-Spray. Wool Master is specifically formulated for Olefin. Ah, just kidding. It's specifically formulated for wool. It contains specialized encapsulating surfactants, detergents, and conditioning agents specifically targeted to soils that penetrate into upholstery fabrics and Oreo rugs. Most wool or fine fabric cleaning agents are just pH reduced carpet pre spray formulations or old shampoos. Woolmaster is a new formulation that was specifically manufactured. It was specifically formulated to clean investment textiles and upholstery fabrics that contain wool fabric. Woolmaster brings state-of-the-art technology to cleaning investment textiles and upholstery made of wool fibers. It was formulated from the beginning for the specific purpose of effectively cleaning the most challenging wool rugs and fabrics and it meets or exceeds industry standards of care for cleaning wool fibers and fabrics. It's to be used on wool and can be used on other natural fabric, rugs, fabric, and carpeting. It has a slightly alkaline pH of 8 to 8.5 8 and it mixes at 1 to 16 to 24. The next cleaning solution that we want to talk to you about is natural orange. Now if Steve Polis were here, he'd tell you this is the chemical. It's one of Steve's favorite cleaning chemicals. Let me tell you some of the reasons why. Natural orange is a long time Hydromaster Clean Master favorite for removing problem spots and soils from upholstery as well as it makes an incredibly great carpet filtration soil spot remover. Natural Orange uses natural citrus solvents to create a gentle, effective, neutral cleaning agent and pre-spotter. It effectively dissolves, dislodges, and emulsifies spots, oils, and grease that contaminate upholstery fabrics. Natural Orange is especially formulated for removing oily spots and soils that are typical to upholstery fabric. A simple, light application of this amazing product will soften and loosen tough oil-bound soil without harming the fabric. And of course, the natural orange fragrance is one that your customers will love. After cleaning, the fabric is left with a noticeable, fresh, clean scent. The product has a neutral pH and contains no harsh solvents. Natural Orange, use it or Steve Polis is coming after you. We've been talking about different types of pre-sprays that are used on upholstery fabrics. Now let's talk about what we run through our machine. 
What's our in-tank solution? The best in-tank solution that HydroMaster Clean Master makes for upholstery cleaning is Rinse Out. Rinse Out is the ideal textile and upholstery fabric acid neutralizing rinse for the final step in the safe and effective cleaning of these upholstery fabrics that we've been talking about. Rinse Out is also effective as a fabric or textile treatment to prevent or correct cellulosic or chemical browning, yellowing, and it can be used to stabilize dyes and colors. Rinse Out neutralizes alkaline and detergent residues and leaves your upholstery fabric with a softer feel. It's safe to use on natural and synthetic fabrics and it assists in breaking down pet urine deposits. Mm -hmm. Rinse Out is an ultra concentrated product that will make up to 320 gallons of neutralizing rinse. Not so now you know why you don't use your carpet pre-spray on upholstery. Quite simply, if you're an upholstery cleaning craftsperson, selecting the right cleaning solution for the right fabric matched to the soil conditions is what separates you from the guy who used to handle baggage for airlines that now cleans upholstery, goes into the customer's house and throws the furniture around. You see furniture for what it really is. It's an expression of the home or business owner's entire decor and environment.